Vincent Hall with Stonebridge Gunworks. Today we're going to look at mounting a red dot and what I do when we do that. So first and foremost we want to make sure that all the oils are cleaned out of the thread holes and out of the actual threads themselves. What I use is a small butane torch to just heat this up and get the moisture out of it like so. And just kind of do this across the optic, but mainly down in those holes there. And I take my optic screws themselves. You could also soak it into natured alcohol or acetone. I find that just doing this, a little butane torch will just where they start to smoke and not getting them too hot there, gets it good to go. Orange Permatex. It is absolutely my recommendation for Threadlocker. It's not as brittle as the Threadlocker Blue. And we definitely don't want to work with red. Just a little bit will do. And we're going to put this primarily on the ends here. Just like that. So just on the end. And I do it while the screws are still warm even. optic mounted. Use a torque wrench on these. I like to go to about 18, right between 15 and 20 on the inch pounds. Definitely not up to 20, but definitely not below 15. Evenly tightening both screws. We end up with a nice mount there. Now, if we warm up the screws like this um, with the thread locker, uh, this is pretty much good to go within an hour. Uh, it's set up. Um, you know, if you do the, if you soak it in acetone or denatured alcohol, you know, give it 24 hours to set up before shooting. And uh, that's how you mount a red dot using thread locker orange.